Ladies and gentlemen, tonight, Top Rank Promotions puts on a pretty good heavyweight main event. I like this fight. F.A. Ajagba out of Africa versus Stephen Big Shot Shaw, St. Louis, Missouri. Ajagba coming in with a 16-1 record with 13 knockouts. Big Shot Shaw coming in with an 18-0 record, 13 knockouts. Safe to say the punches are there. Um, it's possible we may see a knockout tonight. I can't say where it would come from because the styles contrast pretty good. Um, Ajaba, six foot six, weighing in at 234 pounds. He is, I don't want to say a pressure fighter, but he is somewhat of a pressure fighter because he's looking to get the job done by knockout. He wants to hurt you. He wants to destroy you. That's really his mission. Um, he uses his height, but at times he gets frustrated, falls in, I feel like, here and there, especially against his only loss with Frank Sanchez. I feel like the amateur experience showed a lot in a fight like that with Frank Sanchez. Frank Sanchez, you know what I mean, boxed around him, scored big shots in between um, to steal the cards. But I feel like Shaw has the same type of speed as Frank Sanchez, but isn't as explosive, but can get you. You know what I mean? Shaw is a little slicker. I feel like lighter on his feet, um, quicker hands on the inside, you know what I mean, with the combination punching. Uh, I feel like this is going to be a really competitive fight. I feel like they both got something to prove. Both have been in with really good competition. Um, Shaw's last win was against Rodell Booker, who I feel like is a very, very worthy, crafty veteran um, who's not easy to beat. His boxing IQ is through the roof. So I feel like for Shaw to get a win like that, I feel like he's definitely worthy of this opportunity, especially being that he's 30 years old. I feel like this is his coming out party. You know what I mean? This is the fight that'll make him, not make him like as if he isn't any good, but I mean make him in a sense like this is going to be one of the guys we start to talk about because F.E. Ajaba is a big man um, and we do know who he is. But he hasn't got that signature win just yet. So I feel like this is one of those fights where both fighters will elevate from this fight. Even in the loss, you may ele elevate because you're going to learn from this fight. But it's going to be a really competitive fight. I feel like this is going to be the, definitely the fight of the night on the card. Um, this is a really good matchup. I like that top rank is doing this. Um, I mean, I can't really pick a winner. I'm going to be honest with you. I like a job by what he does with the pressure, works behind his jab. You know what I mean? He tries to slam that right hand. Once in a while, you'll get a hook or an uppercut out of him. Um, big, strong guy. I mean, comes in shape. Shaw, six foot four, comes in shape, ready to box, ready to stay sharp. He's very alert. Um, I like his 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 wittiness. I like his boxing ability. I like what he do. But it's 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 great how the styles match up. So I'm I'm really 50-50 on this fight. Um it's definitely worthy to be the main event though on a Saturday night. I like that. That means a lot. It's gonna be a lot of odds on this fight. Um I just can't wait to see what happens. I appreciate y'all for tapping in.